Hi, this is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson. We have Carl here with us this afternoon, and Carl flew all the way over here from the UK, just south of London, to see me because he's been diagnosed with a herniated disc in his lower lumbar spine that's creating lumbosacral radiculopathy, more commonly known as sciatica, but that also comes along with numbness and tingling down the legs and into the feet. Uh, he does, he brought his MRI with him, which is smart. Anybody coming in from out of the country or out of the state, or out of the town even, should bring their diagnostic test with them so I can make appropriate clinical decisions about how to adjust them. He got his very first adjustment this morning, and he's still a little bit sore from that, which is normal. So this is his second treatment. He's really over here basically to avoid having to have surgery, which is what they recommended. Is that correct? Yeah. Okay, let's show them how we do it then, Carl. Let's have you flex your head forward and backwards. It's too early in his treatment to see any significant reduction of the underlying disc pathology and the radiculopathy, but as you can see, he's a big boy. He gives me a workout when I adjust him. We had a couple of huge football players in here today too. Okay, let's lay down right here. This is our very first video since last week. <laughs> Renee and I were depressed all week last week because of Tom Petty dying. And then sick. And then got yeah, sick, physically sick. And then and getting teeth pulled. The end of the week, yeah, Renee <laughs> had to go get some teeth pulled on Thursday. Or a tooth, not some teeth. There we go. That feel tight enough? Yeah. Okay. So see, Carl's a big guy, so he really, we need to Really bring his legs up a little bit higher like that to get them parallel with the floor. Does that feel relaxed to your little back when I do that? Yeah. yeah. Okay. There we go. Keep your teeth together. There we go. That was smooth. Smoother than this morning's. I felt it a lot lower that time. You felt it lower that time? Yeah. yeah. So your reflexes are looking good this afternoon? This one go. Yeah, all those UK crack addicts gonna love you. There we go. <laughs> that was a bloody good ring dinger, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, my friend, let's have you come over here on your tummy for me next. Kind of get up sideways, yep. <laughs> This morning when I did his orthopedic neurological test, his leg was literally three quarters of an inch shorter. Now it's only about an eighth of an inch shorter. I bet you this doesn't tighten up as bad as it did this morning. No, Okay, so I'm gonna get that lower back here. Right now I'm adjusting his SI joints. This one's on the right. The sacrum right down the center, superior to inferior, on the Y and Z axis. There we go. There we go. Boy, my feet about left the ground on that one, Carl. <laughs> Legs are even now. Does this feel any smoother than the first one? Nope. Good. Okay. 
you have juice, add for me, please, sir. There we go. Let's go in your back here now. Carl says it's a little more humid here in Houston than it was over in the <laughs> UK. <laughs> Pretty much start sweating just when you get to near the doors around here, don't yeah, you? Yeah, come out hotel. Yeah, put your arms Let your leg relax right here in my hand. There we go. Good. Okay, relax this one. There we go. Should have felt that one in your knee all the way up in your lower back. And let's sit you up and face this way this afternoon. There we go, good. Well, we've had people here from New York and L.A. and San Diego and North Carolina and where else today? Arizona? Arizona and one from Chicago. Yeah. I think you come the furthest across the pond. <laughs> Stand you up here in front of the mirror. Okay, let's have you flex your head forward and backwards again. Okay, take a look. See, so you're still a little forward and left, so pull your shoulders up and back. Put these guys way back here. I'm gonna bring that head straight back and then kind of look at the wall behind you. Shift your pelvis right. There you go. Hold that over there. Okay. Now, try that same thing again. Yep, take a look now. See your chin's up higher now and your mm -hmm. shoulders are squared off better. Your hands are more at your sides and you got space on both sides now. Mm -hmm. Looking better than it did. So this is your second adjustment here at Advanced Chiropractic Relief and you flew all the way across here from the UK. Uh, would you mind sharing with our YouTube subscribers? how this feels the very first time you get this done this morning there was just no words for it it was you felt it, it hurt for about five seconds and you just felt relief and then just feel a bit of tingling sensation going on and then this afternoon's one felt even deeper felt even better it was, it was a good. deeper adjustment this mm -hmm. afternoon wasn't it? so we broke some of that scar tissue loose yeah. this morning because you get scar tissue and adhesions forming around the disc and the joints and the nerves, and that's what pinches on the nerves as well. Mm -hmm. So would you think this is a better route to go than having surgery, though? I think so, definitely. Yeah, me too. Me too, and I'm wishing the best for you, and we'll check it up on you later this week, letting people know about your progress. <laughs> this is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson, coming to you from Advanced Chiropractic Relief in Houston, Texas, with this huge bloke from the 8th <laughs> UK. We'll see you all soon.